causing accidents. Hmm. Don't look now, because the pants have just come off. Mm. <laughs> Barry, let's continue. What have you got? What I've got is called the doy. OK, this is a very smart little device. Inside this pyramid, which spins, I've loaded it up with kibble, or little tiny dry biscuits. OK, now around the outside is another source of storing food, so that the dog can now uh, play with this thing and learn that food will come out of it. I'm going to demonstrate with Jemima. Where is she? <gasps> Jemima! Yeah, Jemima. yeah girl. So she's going to start eating that. And it won't take her long to realise that I'm going to help her out a little bit. As it spins around, little kibbles start to come out. There it is. The kibble's coming out now. That's going to keep her entertained and she's always got a go-to place. So... I like that. Chris, do you think that's of value? Yeah, the thing we often forget about with pets is that we give them physical exercise, but we actually often don't give them mental exercise. Should they be reading? Well, it, th this is kind of the, the canine equivalent of reading because it requires them to use their mind and you need something that, that fascinates them and that captivates them and will take up a lot of their time trying to solve the puzzle. And, and for that reason, these sort of toys, that they can be quite popular and quite useful. All right, well, you've heard the expert, but what do you think? Is it hot or not? Oh! Hot, 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 hot bags! Thank you. Sit, sit down, darling. Good girl. Oh, isn't she gorgeous? Now, Chris, mm. you are the expert. You're the man who knows everything. I'm very excited to see what you've brought to the table for this pet-related hot or not. All right, everyone's focused on the dogs and the cats, which, which are great. <laughs> Jemima, just settle down. <laughs> 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 but I've decided to go and help out a pet.